Hi, I'm Mike Bloom. I'm an AI solution architect here at Weka. We're here to talk about the infrastructure behind generative AI. Let's talk about RAG. Retrieval augmented generation is a technique that used in natural language parsing that combines the strengths of information retrieval systems and generative models to produce more accurate and contextually relevant responses. The RAG model leverages a two-step approach. It retrieves relevant information from a large data set or knowledge base, such as a vector database, a knowledge graph, or another unstructured data source, and then uses information to generate a more informed and accurate response. This methodology addresses some of the inherent limitations of LLMs, such as hallucinations. When models generate plausible but incorrect or irrelevant information, and the need for constant fine-tuning, by enabling the model to dynamically access and cite relevant information. In a RAG setup, an LLM does not operate in isolation. Instead, it interacts closely with several other components. The core generative model that processes prompts and generates responses is called an LLM, large language model. In a RAG pipeline, the LLM is augmented with retrieval capabilities, allowing it to incorporate information from external databases. API server endpoints facilitate communication between a large language model and a retrieval system and the end user applications. An API server manages requests and responses, ensuring that data flows seamlessly between components. Vector databases store embeddings, which is a numerical representation of textual or multimedia content as symbols generated from documents, PDFs, or other sources. These embeddings enable efficient similarity searches, allowing the LLM to retrieve contextually relevant information. Graph databases and knowledge graphs store structured information and relationships between entities, enabling semantic search capabilities. Knowledge graphs are particularly useful for ensuring that information retrieved is contextually appropriate and factually accurate. One of the advantages of RAG is its ability to cite the sources of retrieved information. This is critical in applications where trustworthiness and transparency are paramount, such as legal, medical, or academic settings. Traditional fine-tuning of LLMs involves retraining the model on a domain-specific data set to improve its performance on specific tasks. However, this approach has limitations, such as a need for large amounts of data, computational resources, and just time. Fine-tuned models can become outdated as new information emerges, requiring further fine-tuning. RAG offers a more flexible and scale alternative. Instead of modifying the model itself, RAG allows the model to dynamically retrieve the latest information from external sources, and this ensures that the LLM's responses are always based on the most current data without the need for continuous fine-tuning. Additionally, RAG can help mitigate the risk of hallucinations where the model generates incorrect or fabricated information by grounding the LLM's responses in real retrievable data. A critical aspect of RAG is how it manages embeddings, particularly in the context of new information. As fresh documents are ingested into the RAG pipeline, embeddings are generated and inserted into a vector database. However, not all embeddings are of equal importance. Over time, older embeddings may become less relevant, especially if we have new pertinent information. The rank-derank process involves evaluating the relevance of existing embeddings and adjusting their priority in retrieval operations. Newer embeddings representing more recent information may be ranked higher, as aging embeddings can be deranked or deprioritized. This ensures the LLM is always able to prioritize the most up-to-date and contextually relevant information when it responds to queries. In a RAG setup, multi-shot prompts can be used to expose the LLM's thought process by sequentially querying the vector DB or knowledge graph and incorporating information into the response. For example, when asking a complex question, the LLM might retrieve multiple pieces of relevant information from the vector DB, combine them, and then generate a response that cites each source. This not only improves the accuracy and the depth of response, but it also provides transparency as sources of the information are clearly cited. REG represents a significant advancement in the development of LLMs, offering a robust alternative to fine-tuning. 
by enabling dynamic retrieval of up-to-date information and ingredient components like vector DBs, knowledge graphs, and rank derank mechanisms, REG ensures that LLMs can provide accurate, contextually relevant, and well-cited information, all while minimizing the risk of hallucinations. This makes REG an invaluable tool for deploying LLMs in the real-world applications where accuracy and reliability are critical. Thanks for watching AI Demystified. See you next time.